The enemy will try to make you think you aren't advancing because of your education. He'll make you think you're not advancing because of your connections or because of your background or because of your family or because of your color and will have you reflecting on that. And then you'll wind up moving into places of anger and then you'll be getting angry at your family and what my mother didn't do or what my family didn't do. But God has called you to be the generational breaker. Come on. He's called you to be the record breaker. That's a prophetic word in your life today. He's He's called you to be the record breaker in your life. What hindered them is not going to hinder you. What stopped them is not going to stop you because you understand who you are. He's looking for someone who will stand up in righteousness. He's looking for someone who will stand up in his authority. And some of you, you got to start taking authority even over your stuff. Say, Satan, get your hand off my stuff. Come on. You're not, you're not getting any more. You're not getting any further. You're not getting any further. Take your hands off. Yeah. And let me prophesy to somebody today there's no time that's lost in the kingdom. What you thought was lost at one point, it is not lost. It is not lost. You can declare and open your mouth and speak things that be not and say, I want it all back. Come on. I want it all back. I want it all back. There's a song that says that I want it all back. Come on. Somebody say, I want everything that was. Now, now mind you, now some of you, some of that stuff you may need to let go. Here's the deal. When God gives stuff back to you all, it always comes back better. It always comes back even better than the way it was found. Because when a thief be found, he's got to repay seven times. Come on. When the thief be found, he's got to repay you back seven times. Some of you are owed some things. Come on. Some of you are owed some breakthroughs. Come on. Some of you are owed some financial miracles. Come on. Some of you are owed some restoration. Some of you are owed some things that were owed to your family because the enemy tried to steal it off of your line. But I decree and declare that it's stopping with you. You will be the one that will break the barrier. You will be the one that will break the generational curse. Come on. When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. Come on. I'm going to say it again. When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. Come on. When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. When the wicked are in authority, the people mourn. But the righteousness of God is here in this place today. Come on. When you realize that you are the righteousness, come on. You say, I am unstoppable. I need you to prophesy it. Come on. I need you just to begin to build it into the atmosphere. Somebody ought to begin to shout about it. Say, I am unstoppable. I'm unstoppable because the greater one is on the inside of me. Come on, a few of you got it. Come on, a few of you got it. Come on, a few of you got it. Come on, we're no longer, we're no longer taking sides. We're no longer taking sides, but we came to take over. I'm telling you, we're no longer taking sides, but we came to take back everything that belongs to us. Come on, your land, your family, your children, your grandchildren, your dreams, your business. I decree and declare you are no longer we're going to be on the wrong side. We come to take over in the name of Jesus. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Come on, you got to have an enough is enough mentality. Come on, you got to have an enough is enough mentality. The kingdom of God suffereth violence, but the violent take it by force. You're getting ready to walk in dominion. God says, I have given the earth to you to have dominion. He said, I've given the earth to you to have dominion. God said, I will step over the millions who don't know who they are to get to the one that does. Because it's in you and his assignment shall be fulfilled.